Flagstaff Snowball has lots of other summer adventures to take advantage of. There's hiking trails and a championship disc golf course. In fact, after seeing this, you may want to trade in your pings for a set of discs. Someone once said, quote, golf is a good walk wasted. Well, if that's true, I can tell you that disc golf and Flagstaff Snowball is a good hike that's not a waste at all. Here's a, something called a jump putt. If you're outside of uh, 10 meters, you can jump when you're putting like this. Forget the chip shot or the sand trap. In this game, you've got jump putts and hammer throws. Disc golf is a sport that's played like traditional golf, which we also call ball golf. It's where uh, you're trying to get the disc into the basket in as few throws as possible. Chris Kirby, also known as Barley, traded in his golf clubs for discs more than 15 years ago and is a regular at the snowball course. As you can see, it's one of the most scenic courses around and has extreme elevation changes which makes for challenging holes. We're up at about 9,500 feet right here and it is very steep. It's like hiking, uh, it's not quite as aerobic because you're starting and stopping a lot, but still it's good for the muscles, good for the lungs. Much like traditional golf clubs, we have a range of golf discs, uh, starting with the putter, which is kind of has a kind of a fat profile, uh, sort of like a traditional frisbee. And then you have a mid-range disc that starts to get more of a beveled, sharper edge on it. Then you get into um, a long-range driver, which is much flatter and more like a discus. And these are designed to go 300 to 500 feet, whereas the putter is designed to go probably about 150 feet. Even if you've never tried disc golf before, it is the kind of sport that's very forgiving. So get out to the beautiful greens of Snowball and just let one fly. Nice.